Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Okay, the average is set to... No, that's too high. If we count the same for that. Would you believe it's for welding? Provides remarkable magnetic insulation, and limits cross-contamination between the neural interface and arms. Doc loves these things. He used them in grad school when he had to manipulate radioactive isotopes. Says seeing them keeps him humble. Man, I remember the first day I interviewed here. Shut up with... Peter is starting to suspect. He hides it, but I can tell. He's seen my twitch. Noticed the decay of my fine motor control. Well, I'm the one who wanted a genius for an assistant. Of course he knows. <sighs> I just need more time. My work can improve millions of lives. Save millions of lives. It can also save my own. I just need more time. Hmm. Let's take a look. Did it! Time for some science. That looks right.
The device will need two parts to function. The first will be an entirely original prosthesis, a modular system of micro cables able to take on any number of forms, whatever the user can imagine. The second part, and this, Peter, is the true genius is a direct neural interface, a direct tap straight into the basal ganglia. Unleash the brain from your mind to reality. This goes beyond limb replacement, Peter. This will free all of us from the shackles of our bodies. Like your web friend, soon we'll all be capable of living our most amazing fantasies. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Okay, looks like I could optimize this power relay. Nice. Okay, what next? Looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit.
finished. Signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter. I call that a mild success. I call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... it can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. To 
direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye! Our next caller reports a problem I saw coming a mile away. Go ahead. Well, I was coming out of the bathtub last night when I glanced out my window, and, and what do I see? Spider-Man, swinging by like he owns the place. I was naked! Madam, you have my sympathies. Just imagine what sort of deviant personality would dress up like that in the first place. And it's a short step from there to Peeping Tom activity. Folks, it doesn't matter if you live on the first floor or the 31st. Keep the curtains drawn. Lock your windows. A webbed pervert walks among us! What are you doing here? Oh, we got a fighter. You just made your last mistake, punk. What the? Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? You hurt? You're Spider-Man. 
You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros, okay? Okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time, but when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought Rhino on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. If the other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's... It's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing. Don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet, and when they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay, Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jaw, okay? okay? I can <clears throat> Oh, sh... S sorry. No, 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 <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> you keep that up and, uh... You'll be fine. All right. Lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey, uh... Thanks. You know, anytime. I just punched Spider-Man. Shelter should be just ahead. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider-Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would've bought it off you, and then he'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Yeah. All right, cool. Later. Oh, come on, get over here. When you say it like that, how would you say it? Tourism is down. There are opportunities huh. Hacking app. I wonder if it still works. Half off. Okay. That'll leave the house. Nice to know you're risking your life. Uh oh. Everyone have their IDs out and ready for inspection. Are you kidding me? This is gonna take forever. That drone wasn't watching. I could jump the fence. You know anyone by the name of Martin Lee? Wow. That was too easy. I can't believe Sable systems are unsecured. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. Maybe I could turn on that siren. <clears throat> oh, the scaffolding will work. Things have mounted guns? I can't let them spot me. Control, grid clear. Oh, nighty night. This will be so cool. It's less terrifying. Whoa! Online 3 with some thoughts. Ken, you're on with J. Jonah James. 
First of all, I just want to say it's an honor to be on your show. Thank you, Ken. You just earned yourself a copy of my new book. Hey, Jonah Jameson, always. Ignore me. I mean, uh, I already have one. Can I get a t shirt or something? <clears throat> okay. Oh, hey, Mom. Hi, honey. Did you make it to the feast shelter okay? Uh, yeah, almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. This is mine. Okay, sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. Oh, honey, I love you so much. We'll get through this, okay? I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. I'll be back soon, Mr. Punch. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no, I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. Oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Huh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these when they're... CR what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Up the time. Get it. Go! Or, could be a loose coax cable. All right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, hey new kid. I'm empty here. Rio and son Miles, as well as brother Aaron. In addition to the hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. Uh, listen, Ked, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. I'll grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Well, that's cool might be able to improve their performance for you. So how's it going with your daughter, Eileen? Slow. I made mistakes raising her. Hard to get past. If you're talking, there's hope. Don't give up. Now that's a wise man right there. Way to have the kids back. 